No, is it time? N please. No. <laughs> Yo, please no. Yo, I'm being honest, bro. Nah. Nah, if Daniel goes UI. If Daniel goes UI at this point, I will officially lose my shit. I will, I will scream. <laughs> Daniel Park. No. My nigga, please. <laughs> oh! How's it going, Squad Nation? It's your boy. Thanks. And today we're back again with more Lucas Up Bros. I'm not even gonna lie to you. These past Lucas Up chapters have been the most heatest chapters I've ever read. Like, bro, just heat back to back. Like, I don't know what the heck the author was cooking, but my goodness. <laughs> Okay, like, it's just back to back to backfire. And I'm just, I'm just surprised. But all in all, bro, we are back with, we're on the very, very recent chapter of Lucasum. We're finally catched up with Lucasum. And the next video, we'll be pretty much doing a catch up of Mary, my husband. Now, before I continue on with the real long, a lot of you guys have been asking, am I going to cover more Magic Cam or Biohead? Because you guys can kind of see that I kind of dropped them off a little bit. And to answer your question, yes. Given the whole situation that that has happened in the end of April, if you guys know, you know. Uh... I wanted to, like, at least limit the amount of Webtoon stuff that I have on my channel. And... What and Lucasum and Mary My Husband is bro. I'm surprised that Mary My Husband even is <laughs> got as much traction as it did. Since those two series are basically the most popular on my channel as of right now, I'm going to continue covering them. But don't be alarmed, I will possibly still cover Ma Magic Him and Biohead sometime in a distant future, in the distant but somewhat near future. But as of right now, Lucasum and Mary Ma has been are definitely going to be my priorities for as of right now. Because especially with Lucasum, because of the amount of projects that was literally held behind. There was going to be some massive fire ass bangers, bro. I'm going to let you guys know. This is, I'm keeping it a book 50. There was going to be some massive bangers for when it came, while I was playing for Lucasum, such as the the, the Riz moments, the disrespectful moments, and a whole bunch of the other stuff I was covering, especially the first ever look of Daniel going UI in the first place. But anyways, those, but obviously those got shelved because I was dealing with the, the, sh the stuff that was going on with me and Webtoon. So, but yeah, those will definitely get its uh, time to the shine. But as of, but you know what I'm saying? You know, after one, but that's after I like cover and catch up with Bear Meisman. But anyways, that's pretty much it. <laughs> that's all I need to talk about with you guys going forward. But anyways, let's not waste any more time. Let's get just straight into the real. All right, here we go, guys, bro. First and foremost, this <laughs> it's still it's still it still hasn't said it yet that this man Daniel in his original body is. In heat mode and technically is in James Lee mode now. <laughs> it's so fucking insane, dog. It's wild. Kid, I see that you got talent, but it's not the same. Even if you have the ability to imitate 10,000 different people, you can't replicate that one man can do. I mean, hey, bruh. It. To a fact, he's kind of speaking a little bit of truth here. I mean, let's be real. This man, James Lee, literally sold a whole generation on his own. But Daniel? <laughs> hey, Daniel's on something different, though, too. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, like let's be real. Like, in the comments down below, when Daniel, uh, Bosco, and Zach, even though that Daniel was in his perfect body, 
if James Lee didn't, like, step in, could Daniel Bosco and Zach actually beat Tatsu? I'm being honest. Like, let me know in the comments down below. Do you guys honest to God think that, that Daniel and Bosco and Zach was actually about, actually had somewhat of a chance against Tatsu? Let me know in the comments down below. But all anyways, bro, you're simply not on his... Bro... <laughs> Man outright says, hey, yo, bruh, cut all this BS out, all right? You are simply not him. And then Daniel Dunn proceeds to prove himself that he is exactly him. <laughs> this is the most funny shit. <laughs> nah, bro, ain't no way, bro. And he has his, bro, and he has his hands in his pocket. Bro, dip. Nah, the disrespect coming, bro. <laughs> the disrespect. <laughs> oh my freaking god, it certainly isn't a cakewalk. He's doing it? <laughs> hey, yes? It's possible to imitate that monster? I mean, let's be real. If we look at Daniel's, like, repertoire at this point, like, this man imitates... What? He, imi he imitates freaking gun. Like, he, he was trained by the embodiment of him and pretty much, mo he pretty much, like... If I'm not mistaken, Daniel could pretty much do and imitate almost every single skill set that Gun has. So it shouldn't be too impossible that Daniel could literally imitate to the fullest extent of what James Lee can do. Like, come on now. Like, <laughs> come on now, my boy. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Daniel's holding him. And the way he fought on that day. Hey, bro, that's insane. <laughs> oh, bro, he gripped him by the leg. Oh, Lord. No, it's impossible. You don't have his speed. Uh, I know that. <laughs> that's why he's <laughs> Yeah. Copying James Lee's moves was a trick from the beginning. This is the attack he was aiming to land, bro. <laughs> bro, that I'm not going to lie, bro. That the spinning kick is... Most definitely Daniel's signature move at this point. Like, bro, Deadass did this shit so many times, both in his perfect body and obviously in his original body now, bro. Like, come on, bro. I, honestly, I think he actually did this to... No, actually, no, I'm, I'm, I'm lying. He didn't do... Well, he did do this to James Lee, but he, like... But obviously, James Lee deflected this shit or blocked it. No way. How can this be? He defeated a first-generation king? I mean, A... If, if we're being honest here, Daniel, Bosco, and Zach, even Eugene, like, deadass admitted it, that Daniel, that they, that they're on the level of a, of a first-gen king, or somewhere close to that, like, come on now, no, not yet, this fight's just getting started, oh, bro, <laughs> okay, first off, why is this man got a cigarette in his head, like, bro, is this man out here trying to be gun now, <laughs> like, bro, come on, bro, uh, come on, oh, only the embodiment of him can smoke, can smoke up a pack and be like, huh, that was refreshing. Now, let me beat your ass now, <laughs> type B, to think the second generation was this strong. So the rumors were true. I heard that those bastards Tatsuma and Sundoku Wang were all fired up at battle against the second generation. And not only that, that Sun. Sekudu Wang even lost to a second generation fighter, hence Eli and Samuel Seo. I'm not surprised he lost. Do you know why I can say all this with confidence? The reason why I'm stronger than the other kings? First of all, not only am I strong, I'm also fast. God, Jesus, okay, okay, Flash, my arms are gonna break off. I need to put some distance between him and me quick. Bro, man said, nah, bro, I ain't letting you get the chance. He's so fast. Is this the true extent of his abilities? Bruh. Lord have mercy. This is dangerous. G bruh, Jesus, I can't even react. This power, it's beyond belief. Bruh, God, God, Jesus. And he's, and he's using the hands now. He's using the freaking, the chops. He's using the chops now, bro. Like, he is he is truly 
undoubtedly being like, okay, you're worthy of these, these, these hands, my boy. I can't hold out. Oh, my Lord. You can't do this alone. We'll join in. So hold on just a little longer, bro. The boys, bro. The boys. Daniel Park. God. They. Jesus. You can't. You made that call way too late. You choose Chef. Come at me from the start. Jesus Christ. This man. Bruh. <laughs> now, nah, this man is on a different level. Well, technically. Now we can see why this man is basically called the king of all the other first generation kings, bro. If we're not mistaken. Now, let me see what Tatsuma's precious protege can do. Oh, here we go. What? No. No, is it time? N please. No. <laughs> Yo, please, no. Yo, I'm being honest, bro. Nah. Nah, if Daniel goes UI. If Daniel goes UI at this point, I will officially lose my shit. I will, I will scream. <laughs> Don't do this. Don't do this, nigga. Daniel Park. No. My nigga, please. <laughs> oh! Daniel Park, do you know why I chose you? Um, because I'm a blank canvas? Wrong. Oh, j bro, what? This is why. He knows Daniel has you. I mean, technically, he knows Daniel, like, the, his perfect body has UI. He knows that. But I don't know. But does Gun know that Daniel has UI if he goes into his original? What? I saw potential in you. To become, to become exactly like me. Oh, shit. So, well, this plainly confirms that Gun has UI. <laughs> now, that plainly, that basically confirms it. It's canon now. <laughs> Gun uses UI. I'm quite surprised that there's another person besides that other Daniel Park who's capable of this. L let me breathe. You learned everything there is to know about fighting from me. I've recorded in your body every type of fighting technique under the sun. Remember this feeling of dying. Even in the throes of death, be prepared to fight. Let death take overtake your body once you grasp Ultra Instinct. With what you've learned from me, you'll be able to even beat a first generation. <laughs> Good God, look at this thing! <laughs> nah, bro, this thing is a demon. It's a demon, but the quest, but the real question is, is Daniel like truly conscious? Because obviously, Gun literally just blatantly fucking confirmed that that Gun that he actually know, that he that he uses UI. So the but the big question, but Gun is conscious of it. He's conscious of it, and he's obviously talking. You know, what I'm saying black and white eyes, right? So the question is, is Daniel? Is he even conscious? Because <laughs> every time that Daniel went UI, his subconscious takes over and stuff like that. Hell, even sometimes it goes become full freaking sentient. So is Daniel conscious of this? That is the million dollar question. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> yeah. Nah, bro. Jesus Christ, Daniel. <laughs> I see. This is it. This is why he was defeated. I see. I understand why Sun Deku Wang lost. I'm not like the other kings. 
I'm now a bloodthirsty maniac who enjoys the thrill of a fight, but I'm feeling fired up now. I'm curious. Bro, this is insane. <laughs> but the, again, the real massive question is, is Daniel actually fully conscious of, like, as he goes, why? That is the million dollar question. Oh my God, of the second generation. See if you can withstand my fangs. Oh, yo. Okay. Okay. What a terrifying young man you are. Are you trying to kill each other? Both of you calm down. There's no longer a need to fight. No way. What is going on? Who is that man? What? Bro. Hello? Yo, they man just downright deflected both. The okay, this man is a demon. What? You're going to send this old man to an early grave. Snap out of it at once. Oh. Bro, Daniel just outright just snapped out of you like completely. <laughs> Bro, who is this man? Who is this man? What? That man is, bro. That yeah, that's the dude that was on the tractor and shit. What the hell? The old man from Sewell who I manned the village. Bro, hello, who is this? Sorry for all the commotion we've caused. What brings you here, sir? Who is this? I rushed over here to stop you be because I blatantly came to a realization. I'm not sure what you mean, you fool. Can't you tell by looking at that young man's face? My face? What does that mean? Have you already forgotten that man's face? Can't you see it in this young man? Bro, he's pointing two and two together that Jung Young and Daniel look, look alike. Because I can clearly see. That's right. Ji Young Park's face when he was young. Bro, what in the freaking hell is this? So that basic, I mean... Technically, it kind of confirms it that Daniel and Jin Young are basically somewhat related. So, bro, we've caused him, we've caused him great offense. Could it be? That's right, Ji Chang. You lot, you lot were mistaken from the beginning. This young man was never our enemy. He was simply looking for Ji Young Park. I can assure you, these boys weren't sent by that bastard. So, young man, Daniel Park was it? Now that I figured you out. Figure it out. I suppose I should address you as Young Master. I knew it! <laughs> this basically makes it fucking get it! Hello? This basically confirms that Ji Young and Daniel are like father and son. What the heck? You said you came to the countryside because you wanted to know more about Ji Young Park, isn't that right? I will tell you everything. Baku, no. Gabriel Kim's driver! The dr okay, <laughs> okay, okay. This okay. This is insane, dog. Ain't no freaking way. The drive. <laughs> you know what? He's from the pre-generation. Okay, everybody in the pre-gen was built fucking different, including the damn driver. Apparently. Oh my lord. So it's can that it's called Ultra Instinct now. I mean, technicality is wasn't it already canon? <laughs> like, bro. All right, I'm not mad at it. <laughs> Being trained by gun and having Ultra Instinct now. D yeah, Daniel has now become broken. This man needs a nerf. <laughs> Could it be possible that Ji Young is a relative of Daniel? Or is is he... Or is is his lookalike from an experiment? Again, the man said that I suppose I should call you Young Master. So it it blatantly like makes it makes it clear that or at least somewhat clear that Daniel and Ji Young are like father and son at some at, at the very least, you know what I'm saying? But oh my god, this chapter, bro. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie to you, bro. I don't know what the artist, what the author is smoking right now, but this man is just on fire with these chapters, bro. The, like, literally the last dead ass, the last chapter was just Daniel in heat mode. And now this man's you. Bro, this man Daniel is fucking broken. <laughs> he is broken. Someone get this man a bounce patch, please. But, anyways, guys, that is pretty much it, bro. This. 
the, what else is there to be said? <laughs> Other than the fact that now it's, I guess you could say it's confirmed now that Daniel and Ji Young are basically father and son because apparently the freaking Gap Young Kim's driver basically kind of pretty much confirmed it, which by the way, the fact that that driver is still alive and the fact that he was able to both block damn Daniel Park's kick and UI and a first generation king of all kings punch or chop speaks for itself. I mean, to be fair, make, it makes sense because again, if you look at Tom Lee, it, like again, Tom Lee is like the primest example. Like this man as... The pre-generation was just wild. <laughs> they were a different breed of a different timeline. But anyways, guys, that's pretty much it for this video. Like this video in the comments down below, bro. <laughs> in the comments down below. In the comments. Like, now that Daniel pretty much pretty much can use UI now in, the, in his original body, the only question is, does he, like, have full control over it like Gun does? Or... Is he like similar with just how he is in his perfect body where obviously if he gets knocked the hell out or obviously on the near freaking death, somehow it just activates. Let me know in the comments down below. But anyways, like, comment, share this video across social media if you can, and subscribe if you're using my channel. This is Blaze Like Signing Out. And as always, thank you guys so much for watching. Peace!